Hello, this video is about my turn, your turn. Most children are starting to develop the ability to take part in real interactions with the people around them. They are beginning to learn how to talk and play with parents, carers, teachers and peers. But before children can take part in meaningful interactions, they need to learn the skills to take turns. Turn taking is a skill that plays an important role in social successes. Often children struggle with the concept of taking turns or sharing toys, leading to difficulties when playing with others. However, we can use a variety of strategies and interactive games such as My Turn, Your Turn to help combat this. Involve your child in turn taking games such as conversations, finger play and sharing toys. These activities will help develop the skills that they need to interact well with others. Turn taking is one of the most basic parts of communication. Children who get lots of practice at turn taking will find it easier to play with others and interact well. My Turn Your Turn encourages children to develop their listening skills, their waiting skills, sharing and builds upon vocabulary, as well as introducing new vocab to the children. It can increase interactive skills with yourselves and other children and increases children's engagement as well using toys that they find that are most engaging for them. Also, you can add music to a turn taking game, which is inspiring and motivating for a lot of children. When teaching a turn taking game with a child, it is critical to consider your child's developmental level and language skills. Think about the verbal instructions that you are giving to the child. Do they need more of a gestural prompt rather than a verbal prompt? Before we start a turn taking game, it's important to ensure that the child understands that why do they need to take turns, understand when it is their turn to take, and have self-regulation skills to handle waiting as it's not always their turn. Also, when taking part in turn taking games, it's important to think about the vocabulary that you are using. It's my turn, it's your turn. These vocabulary skills will be then passed on when they are playing with their peers as well. When you first start playing games with children, think about the waiting times as well. Little children find waiting really difficult, so the waiting time needs to be considered. Are you going to take part in an activity that is on the mat, which is where they are most comfortable, or at a table, and how long do you want them to interact with? Is it a few seconds, or are you going to build that up over time to a minute or longer? Some children that find waiting difficult, you can add in a fiddle toy that they can hold and that when it is not their turn, they've always got something to hold. This can also reduce anxieties as well when they are used to holding a favourite toy. You can also add in a timer. The timer can be used on the iPad or a visual timer or a sand timer so the child knows exactly when it's their turn or when their turn is coming to an end. Each time you play the game, ensure that praise is given to the child. Yay, well done, that was your turn. You had a really good turn, well done. Obviously, depending on the child that you are working with, keep the vocab minimal, but if they need more and you can give them more, then that is great as well. Clapping, cheering is always successful with children as well. They find it motivating and want to engage in more games with you. You can start with sharing one object, to two objects, to three objects, and build this up over time to then work on sharing a, a simple game such as a shape sorter or building on two board games as well. So top tips for turn taking and my turn your turn games. Keep the waiting time short, use engaging objects and most importantly have fun. A little information about the videos that we took with the children. In the first video you will see a child playing on the carpet with one adult to start with, waiting for short periods of time to engage with the toy and taking turns with herself and an adult. The second video then moves on to a second child joining the interaction, taking turns between the adult and the child and then the adult and the other child. This is increasing the waiting time that the first child has to wait. Also you will see that we've added a few more objects in as well at this point. In the third video you will see that the child is not sat down at a table or on the carpet but this child prefers to stand. That is also okay. You can see how the child becomes excited when it is his turn and when it's not his turn he's excited about the object what is coming he moves away from the table but he always comes back and when things go wrong such as the battery the sound pack falling out of the the bag we carried on that was fine so if things go wrong just carry on because he was still engaged ready sit down sit down sit down
ready? Sit down. Your turn. Sit down. Sit down. Good boy. Your turn has finished. My turn. My turn. Ready? My turn. Ready? Your turn. Your turn. Your turn. Yes. Ready? 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 Your turn. Your turn. No. One more? Yes. My turn. Ah! And... And my turn. Good boy. Play another game? I like this one. Okay. Whose turn is it? Like it's my turn. So it's your turn. Yeah. So you're going to say my turn? My turn. So we'll play it? Yes. Okay. It's my turn. 
And now it's Austin. Your turn. Your turn. My turn. And Ready? Your turn. Ready? My turn. Yes. Your turn. Ready? Your turn, my turn. <gasps> Ready? My turn. Catch it. Your turn, my turn. <gasps> Ready? Yes. My turn. Your turn, my turn. One more. Okay, yes. My turn, good boy. And one more. Your turn. And finish. 